So today I'm going to be talking to you about and showing you some of my go-to hair products Well, more like conditioning and deep condition conditioning and deep conditioning products that I use for my dry and damaged hair um, So my hair is color treated. I've colored a bazillion times if you've known me since I started my channel or just about You'd know I've dyed it a million, uh, a million times highlighted it um, I do all and everything you can possibly do to your hair almost I've highlighted it a uh, which is bleaching it like a lot of times and I've dyed it more than a handful of times and I put heat on it so yeah I was gonna try to count it down for you but I can't so anyways I finally dyed my hair brown and I'm trying to get it back to being healthy um so I think I'm gonna stick with this but don't hold me to it because I honestly don't know I feel like once you start dyeing your hair you, you just can't stop it's really hard but anyways let's just get into the video and I just wanted to let you guys know that if you're not already subscribed, please hit the subscribe button down there because I'd really appreciate it. And I also wanted just to wish you guys a happy early Thanksgiving or happy holidays, whatever you celebrate. And I love you guys and let's just get into it. <laughs> so I'm going to first start off with um, the deep conditioning more like. I guess one of the deep conditioning. It's, um, it's coconut oil that I use. So yes, you can use coconut oil to cook, or you can also put it in your hair. Shh, don't tell anybody, okay. So anyways, um, if you're going to buy it, make sure to buy the virgin or the um, unrefi uh, unrefined, unprocessed. Make sure it's not processed or anything like that. You want it to be virgin, and yeah, this one happens to be organic, superfood, whatever that means. So um, that's just what this looks like, and it's the Nutiva brand. Or Nutiva, I don't know how to, I don't know how to say that. So yeah, so it just looks like this, and it's like a solid form. It's not actually like oily, but it melts in your hand. So yeah, and I bought this from Fairway Market. I don't know if you guys have that in your area, but that's where I bought it. And yes, so it just looks like this. So I'll just take some of it into my hands, and I'll melt it in my hands, and I'll put it. Um, at the bottom of my ends if my hair is dry and I just want some extra nourishment and to make it look a little more shiny or if I want to do it as a deep conditioning I'll just take a little bit actually probably a lot of it and I'll put it all over my ends and then um like during the nighttime and then I'll put it in my handy dandy shower cap put that on and then I'll sleep with it overnight and then the next day I'll wash it out twice with shampoo and then regular conditioner whatever you're going to do and if you do that at least once a week, um, it'll help your hair a lot, and it's a really good deep conditioning treatment. So there's that. <clears throat> and then next, uh, another deep conditioning is the 3 Minute Miracle from Aussie. It's really affordable. I've used it for a while, and I really like it. Um, so yeah, that's just what it looks like. And I just put this in my hair after shampooing it in the shower, and then I'll wash it out after like 3 minutes. This isn't a leave-in, so yeah. And then I'm going to be talking to you about a spray. It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In. This happens to be the keratin one, but it doesn't matter what you get. I just happen to get the keratin one. So it just looks like that. And this does a lot. It um, protects your hair against heat, so it has a heat protectant. It's supposed to detangle, defrizz, and add shine. And um, seal your cuticles for extra silky hair. So I just spray this in my hair after the shower, and then um, I comb it out with a wide tooth comb and then it um if I'm gonna heat style it I don't even need to put heat protecting because it has heat protectant and if not it's a really good detangler by itself and a conditioner and I really have something in my throat so okay. <clears throat> so moving on I'm gonna show you uh, oil so this is the macadamia Macad I can't talk ever Ever, ever, ever. Macadamia Professional Nourishing Moisture Oil Treatment. I have to stop doing this. I don't know why I do. So it's medium to coarse, and I just put a little bit of A little bit of this in my hair. Um, usually when it's dry, just to add shine. 
in the bottom right here and it's really it's really silky and it really helps your hair i really like this oil so yeah got it from ulta if you're wondering next i'm going to be showing you something to help because you're not supposed to be washing your hair every day and uh it's dry shampoo and this is the dry shampoo i use it's the not your mother's clean freak refreshing dry shampoo and this is the unscented version I believe they do have a scented version, so I don't know what kind of scents. So yeah, it doesn't really smell like anything. And since I don't want to wash my hair every day or, or every other day, I try to go even longer. I spray this in my roots and comb it out, and it really helps my hair. So yeah. And then last but not least, uh, I have a DIY for you. DIY, I, yeah. I really wish I could talk, but I can't. So anyways, um... It's really simple. It's for your own like spray or leave-in conditioner or detangler or whatever you want to use it for. So you just use whatever conditioner you're using. This is the conditioner I have. And you need a spray bottle and some water. So what you'll do is you'll um, fill your uh, bottle, your spray bottle up with conditioner. And you should do like a 2 to 1 ratio. So you should do like two, um, I guess, I don't, you, you really don't need exact measurements. Just make sure to do double the conditioner than the water you use. Uh, or half and half even. I haven't done this in so long, but you literally just put the conditioner in the bottle. You can do half and half, I was wrong. And just put the water in, you shake it up, and then you have your own detangler. And my mom used to always show me this, so it's really helpful and I know it works. So if you ran out of your conditioner and you were looking for an idea of how to make some really quick, you can do that or you can, yeah, do that. So <laughs> I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.